East Valley teenagers are facing charges after allegedly throwing fireworks at a barn. The fire broke out in the backyard of a Gilbert home near Guadalupe and Higley Roads. The homeowner says people were inside the barn at the time, but luckily no one was hurt. 12 News journalist Gabriela Becerra spoke with the homeowner and shares why she says her family was targeted. <laughs> It only took minutes for a firework to send this barn up in flames. It was so scary. Like there's just like so much smoke and like like giant like just it didn't feel real. Fire. Yeah. Lexi Jones says she and several of her friends were hanging out inside the barn on Wednesday night when a group of boys showed up and allegedly started harassing her. <laughs> no one was expecting what happened next. What's most upsetting is that there's just the malicious intent. Like they you knowingly shot a firework towards a building that had kids in it. Lexi's mother, Jenny Jones, says the boys ran off before they realized the damage that was done. Honestly, I I can't even like process that. Like I I just can't even think about that because it, like I get sick to my stomach. Jones is thankful everyone made it out of the barn. Everything inside is now charred. Sad, like there's just a lot of memories in here and like a lot of memorable stuff and like irreplace irreplaceable stuff. Gilbert police say they arrested two teens on charges of arson of an occupied structure and endangerment. Jones says her family knows the teens arrested and claims more were involved. She says the others are now sending threatening messages to anyone they think might snitch. The others are accomplices and I think until they're caught like I feel like the retaliation is still going to happen and I think that's what needs to get stopped because kids are afraid to speak up because when they do speak up, they're getting threatened by these kids. Gabriella, thank you. Now, Gilbert police say that they are still investigating. A GoFundMe page has been started to help the Jones family rebuild their barn. We've got a link to that on our website, 12news.com.